70 trucks carrying soya beans from Central Province destined for Nakonde have been impounded in Pika for illegally conveying the commodity. This follows a directive by the government to ensure that all grain and soya beans destined for Nakonde is accompanied by authentic documentation. And Machinga Province Permanent Secretary Devison Mulenga has directed security agencies in the region to be vigilant and ensure no maize grain and other farm produce are smuggled outside the country. Look at uh, where the maize that you are growing is going. We have a problem in uh, central province. Like I mentioned there, where people have infiltrated uh, central province and they are buying soya beans in mass. So there is an outcry there that uh, we might end up having no soya beans in the country. And uh, you and uh, I know that we use that soya beans for many issues, even for the feed for animals. But uh, a lot of it is coming. Government has launched three trade manuals aimed at increasing information flow on trade from government to stakeholders engaged in trade and industry. The documents are the coordination mechanism between the central and provincial levels, the trade related and the mainstreaming manuals. Commerce, Trade and Industry Permanent Secretary Mushuma Mulenga says the trade related manual will provide an overview of Zambia's trade policy in relation to the country's engagement at bilateral, regional and multilateral levels. He was speaking when he opened the workshop for stakeholders in Mongo and the launch of the manuals. Meanwhile, Western Province Permanent Secretary Danny Wakali implored the Ministry of Commerce to commission the industrial yards in the province to enhance trade in the region with neighboring Angola and Namibia. Okay, that's the first one. So we have to see what the, what the second one. Second one, like I indicated, this is a it's a handbook on trade mainstreaming. So it actually gives participation in Comesa and SADIC and the tripartite uh, trade free trade area. I think it would be important for us to enhance coordination between the central and provincial levels of of, of government. Most of the timber processing is being taken to Vietnam. China and, and by our colleagues who come and invest here. Hence, resources being taken away. But we know that with the industrial yards that you've brought in, we are going to have the locals that are going to venture into that. Mm -hmm. That will promote the value addition within the, the, the province. That will keep the resources within the province. That will develop the province. So we, we, we actually see us with that PS. We want to work with you closely to ensure that the, the, the industrial yards are actually commissioned.